All right, it's Donovan here. So what we got is a our CC Scorpion pistol, and we are going to we got a new handguard for it, so we need to get the barrel nut off. So anybody who knows anything about these knows that the damn thing is just a bear to get off. The barrel nut is right here, and you can see I actually have the Gen 2 model, so I've got half by 28 threads too. But the barrel nut right here has, uh, it's notorious for having a crap ton of uh, red Loctite. So I did some check-in and a lot of people recommend these HB Industries uh, barrel nut wrench wrenches. I have one of those, um, but people have had some issues with, still having issues with getting them off. So. Uh, did some research and somebody said using this a few times over the course of a couple days makes it come off real easy. So we're going to go ahead and give it a shot. Um, to put a few drops up on the threads and come back every so often and whenever it's gone and it's, you know, gone down the threads to go ahead and uh, add a little bit more. So that's what we're going to do. And then supposedly it only takes like 20, 25 pounds of torque in order to get the barrel nut off. So we're going to give it a shot. All right, that's good for now. We'll let that sit for a while and uh, come back and do another another application later. Audi. So I'm just putting a thin layer on there and it soaks down inside the threads. So we'll see how it is in the morning. I'm going to bed. Out. All right, so it's the next morning. Let's see uh, how much of it has dripped down into the threads and uh, take a gander. So you can see that the liquid has actually gone down off of the threads and drifted down underneath that barrel nut. So let's add some more. Okay, so you can see I've got a bead sitting right down on the bottom of the threads, right on top of that barrel nut. So we'll let that sit all day and come back and check it. Okay, so it's only been about three hours. None of that stuff is left. So we're going to add some more and check it again later. All right, so it's been a couple of days and uh, we've done this several times. The uncure continues to disappear down inside the, uh, the barrel nut. So we're gonna do this one more time Give it a good, uh, put a put good beat on here, and when I get home from work today, we're gonna try to crack it off. So we'll see how it goes later. All right. So see the bolts back, no magazine. Uh, for anybody that was worried about it a little bit before, the magazine was empty. Don't don't get your panties in a bunch. So it's been several days, and. Uh, We've been using this debonder, this uncure from Bob Smith Industries. Uh, every couple hours, come back, reapply it, and we're just letting it uh, soak down into the threads underneath the uh, 
underneath this uh, barrel nut. So we're going to try to break it free and see how it goes. Um, been told you can use a plastic bag to help with marring. Now to uh, break it loose, we're going to use uh, the barrel, barrel wrench, uh, the barrel nut tool that we got from HBI Industries. We'll see how it goes. Uh, test fit it quick to make sure that it fits on. Fits on no problem. Make sure that you're secure here so it doesn't twist. Make sure you're going the right way too. Definitely moved. You see we're pretty loose here. There we go. There was a bunch of gunk up in there. So let's uh, take a closer look here. That's what was there. So it's definitely all this stuff was up on the top. All right, so uh, there you have it. Um, really wasn't too hard at all. Just it took some time because of having to wait a couple hours between applications of the uh, debonder or the uncure um, but it was really easy so I mean you can send it off and have somebody get it off for you if you want to I mean um, with this method I really don't see any point in trying to heat it up and trying to break it with heat and you know risk beating the hell out of it for uh, you know marring up your gun all right so I guess that's it for uh, the CZ build uh, first video um, if you like what we're doing on the channel, go ahead and like, subscribe, share it with your friends. Uh, come out on the Facebook and check us out there at Deco Family Shooters. And uh, we're also on Instagram quite often. Snapchat, not so much, but you can find us on Instagram at Deco Family Shooters as well. So uh, do your part. Get out there, get to the range, and when you go, take a buddy. Better yet, take a buddy who's never shot a gun before. Better yet, take a woman that's never shot before. Better yet, take a kid. Start the next generation shooting. All right. This is Donovan. I'll check you later. Out.